Okay, keep your eyes closed. Okay. I want to show you my first ever painting. Mm, all right. Okay. Open your eyes. Oh, that's a lot of colors mm -hmm. <laughs> and shapes. So be honest. What do you think? Well, uh, I like how if you switch to Geico, you could save hundreds of dollars on car insurance. Oh yeah, that's that's true. Yeah. Here, why don't I hold your paintbrush while you call them? Geico, because saving fifteen percent or more on car insurance is always a great answer. Welcome to Blog Talk Radio in high fidelity. Jimmy Mack is a renowned medical intuitive and spiritual life coach who has taken, completed, and even mastered a variety of healing modalities. After a near-death experience, he was shown and developed a simpler way to create healing and profound changes, now known as My Liquid Fish. He works with clients in person, on the phone, and over Skype worldwide, accessing energetic powers and co-creating changes that you can actually feel. Call in now to reserve your spot on the switchboard. The call-in number is 713-955-0594. Press 1 if you would like to ask Jimmy Mac a question. Enjoy this one hour of profound healing. Hey everybody, it's Jimmy Mack coming to you live. We're glad everybody's here. We appreciate you tuning in for the show. It's every Tuesday at 12 noon Eastern Standard Time. So you're welcome to always call in. And of course, we have free healings, free readings. Everything is our devotion of service. And it's all going uh, to help others. That's what it's really all about. So we appreciate everybody being here. And we want to at least uh, let you know what's coming up this summer. And to let you know, we do have a whole lot of folks coming up next Tuesday. Uh, it's going to be, of course, our resident trans medium. And it's Reverend Debbie Dean Spear. And she does communication with the other side in heaven. And so it's really quite a dream. So if you have any loved ones uh, that you'd like to talk to in spirit, she's your gal. Uh, it's amazing the things she brings up and brings to you from spirit, and it's uh, it's really quite uh, quite something to see. So we appreciate everybody being here, and we appreciate your follow-up. We've got quite a lineup for the whole summer, everyone from Alma Meyer to also uh, Rudy Hunter. You bound to have heard of some of these folks, Zarathustra, and Jane Sibbett, my old crush from Friends. If you remember the TV show Friends, that was Ross's wife, a beautiful blonde girl, and she now does uh, Jane's healing hands. So isn't that interesting? And she used to support, and of course, with a bunch of very famous healers, and really has come into her own as far as all that goes. So reach out, info at jimmymachealing.com is, of course, the email address. And if you're not on our weekly TGI Wednesday, you definitely want to get on that. And uh, definitely join up for that. Every week we send out a little email, and it just has comics on it, audio MP3s. Uh, it's an e-newsletter, of course. There's MP3s on there, um, videos, a lot of different things. They're all free. So you definitely want to get in touch with us on that. Also, we are in the process full underway right now. For My Liquid Fish, you can visit myliquidfish.com. That's my modality and technique that came to me during the near-death experience. And so it's very profound and yet very simple. We have both levels of mastery for those of you that want to work on yourself and, of course, family and friends. And then even after that, if you decide, you can do certified practitioner training. And that's also an awesome level to go to the next level for those of you who want to be uh, doing basically what I'm doing daily, which is working on clients uh, in person, phone, and Skype worldwide. And it's really invigorating and it's exciting. There's always something to be done. And 
is it's uh, it's really a good thing. So we're happy that uh, everybody is with us, and we appreciate everybody being here. And today's guest is Tony Green, and she is a hypnotist, a healer, an intuitive reader, author, radio host, has her own show on the A1R network, super highly rated uh, psychic show network, if you've heard of it, and also even uh, does her own TV show. So we're excited about that. You can find out more information at T-O-N-I-G dot info. So it's www dot, of course, Tony G dot info. So she's calling in from the great state of Wisconsin. Hopefully she can hear me now. All right. Hey, Tony, how are you today? Hey, Jimmy, I'm doing well. How are you? I'm great, honey. Hopefully everything's coming through. We've got a lot of thunderstorms in the in the east, so it has a lot to do with some of the technical difficulties, I think, uh, but we're glad you're here and welcome. And, you know, I want to say this is my longer introduction of you. I really vet all the people I have on the show. I mean, I've talked to everybody ahead of time. I want to make sure they're the real deal. I want to make sure they can deliver. Um, and, you know, with the exception of very few guests who I knew ahead of time were really touting their own methodology or their own book launch or whatever they got going on. It's quite funny, um, you know, Certainly, we've talked together. We've worked on other shows together. Uh, you're the real deal, too, and I've experienced it. I've seen it. Uh, you've been, like me, you've been doing this a long time, so we're excited you're here, and you know, we'll let folks know also we've got a lot of callers on the line, and more people will be raising their hands. I always let our, our guest or co-host go first, and so when you come on the line, folks, grab one question also. Uh, you don't want to ask this woman nine things. You know, let's save that for a real personal reading off the air. But thanks for being here. How are you today? Oh, Jimmy, I well, thank you so much. It's such an honor to be on your show, and I'm um, I'm doing well. I'm doing really well. And uh, oh. I just want to say, also, I know that your listeners know you're amazing, and you really. I uh, have done so. You do some incredible work, but if they haven't experienced you, they really need to get on that and experience your your work because it is quite amazing and life changing. I might add, yeah. Oh, you're sweet. You're sweet. I appreciate it. That's awesome. Hey, uh, tell folks a little bit about you. And I know you've done a little bit of everything and healing and hypnotists and readings and channeling and TV and radio. I mean, what do you really like? What do you, you enjoy helping people with relationship issues or finance or what, what's what been the latest thing for you? Okay, so, yeah, you know, for as long as I can remember, I've been what I call a channel. And I, I, I say channel because, you know, I channel um, that God energy. So people ask questions and information just comes right through me. For them, and Max wants to be a part of the show. Come on, buddy, get yeah. in there. Um, and uh, so that has been for as long as I remember. Even though in my childhood I had no idea what I was doing, it just came out of me so naturally. As um, as I matured in years, I started, you know, searching for modalities to help heal people. So I ended up doing some healing uh, certification. Uh, one that you have, Reconnective Healing. And then um, <clears throat> that was my first introduction to healing work. And then I went into hypnosis. Um, and then after that, I I kind of, I learned some things I could do on my own. Like if people are familiar with Bratzo, I can gaze, that gazing where you look at someone or a group of people and these really miraculous things start to happen for them. These changes come in. Um, and then there's another form of energy work that I do also. But more recently, uh, having played with the fish, uh, that's been pretty profound and stunningly amazing, uh, the work that you do. And, and uh, oh. But my main thing is what I love doing and what I've what it, I've done since I was a child is the channeling. I've actually channeled four books that are published, and I have a fifth one that will be um, that's in editing right now. And um, they've already told me what my next book is going to be. It's called Answers from Above. 
So the book that's in editing right now is called Messages from Above, which is a theme in my life. And then Answers from Above are is the next book I'm doing, which is going to be pretty profound, and it's going to include a lot of people. So I'm very excited about that book. And I think that's everything about me. Yeah. Love it. Yeah. And I, boy, I've got a great guy for you for pre-publishing. So let me know. And I, I tell you and the world and everybody listening, it's Lighthouse24 and his name is Doug. So it's lighthouse24.com and he does pre-publishing. He will go over your whole book. He puts in table of contents. He helps you with the book cover. He helps you turn it into a Kindle file. Um, also goes through, of course, Create Space. So you can do a printed book. Uh, he's a dream and very, very, very reasonable. So I Amazing. Him out Thank you. Again. Yeah, Lighthouse 24. His name is Doug. And you can tell anybody that gets a hold of him, tell them Jimmy Mack sent you. If you engage him, he'll all on what he would do and then how much it would be. So he's extremely reasonable and uh, he's what my mother calls terribly honest. So there you go. So <laughs> Excellent. In that, area, in that realm, it's pretty rare. So we're yeah. glad you're here. Hey, folks, uh, you know, hit hit one if you want to raise your hand and get uh, some messages from Tony. And if you need healing from myself, I'm here as well. Narrow it down to one thing. If you got ten things going on physically or ten relationship issues, let's grab something that we can work on for you all. And if you need a healing, you want to be hydrated, stand up, do north, that sort of thing, be hands free. And hopefully the dogs aren't barking and you're not trying to drive down the road uh, in your car getting. <laughs> so we'll jump to the phone lines. Hey, hey, Kathy, you're a first caller. Four four three is the area code. Hi. Where are you calling from? What's going on? From, from Maryland. Um, okay. It's not, a, it's, um, it's not a whole lot. I was just wondering what's coming up on my path. Okay, it's kind of hard to hear you, sweetie. So you definitely want to speak into the phone oh, better. Was, there. There you I go. I was wondering. I was wondering what's coming up on my spiritual path. That's okay. Do you want to narrow it down for for Tony? In other words, what does that mean to you? <clears throat> so. Healing. Crystals, um, more classes. <laughs> I see. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Kathy, the first thing I get for you is is you want to be a jack of all trades. And you don't know, with, you know, you, you kind of, what you do, Kathy, and um, this is not an insult in any way. It's just, it's just an honest assessment that's going to hopefully help catapult you into what you really love. What you do is you... You hear about something, you gravitate towards it, you, you want it, you cling to it, and then you that lasts for a few moments until you hear about the next thing, and then you want the next thing and the next thing and the next thing. So you you know a little bit about a lot of things. Is that accurate? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Thank you. So what they're saying, and hey, listen, there is nothing wrong with that because what you've been doing up until now it's like going through a deck of cards and saying ah this card is nice okay now I don't like it anymore oh this card is nice now now I want something more and the, the truth of the matter is you just haven't found the thing that really resonates and works with you the thing where you're seeing those really good results the thing where you're seeing that really profound power coming through and going oh my goodness this this really works right Mm -hmm. So what I'm going to, what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to pitch Jimmy right now because I've done a little bit of that. You know, I, I did the reconnective. I did the, I do the gazing. And I think that both of those are very, they have a very great place. And if you, if you've worked with Jimmy or not, um, his work really instantly, you, you just, you, you get into this and you start playing with it. It's really amazing. I think there is a class coming up for you. You're going to be taking and studying something over the next six months. Stick with it over the next six months. And it is a healing modality. <clears throat> and you, if you stick with this over the next six months, if you, if you dedicate and devote yourself to it and stick with it over the next six months, at the end of it, you're going to be so profoundly happy, not only with what it's done for you, but what it's done for everybody that you care about and those that 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 you encounter, okay? Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Now, have you have you done Jimmy's work yet? Have you experienced it yet? Um, online healing when I call in. Okay. Okay. I want you to. I'm I'm really serious about this, and I'm not just saying this because he's on the phone with us. Jimmy, plug your ears for a moment. Um, I, I've referred several people to Jimmy and have uh, some of my practitioner friends have told them they should think about it. Now, let's let Jimmy do something, something for you and see what we, where we get with this, okay? Yeah, mm-hmm. and that's, ahead, fine. that's fine, too. And Kathy, I, I leave it out there to everybody to do whatever they're drawn to. Uh, I'll certainly send you information on it. You can read all about it. Uh, what they're immediately whispering to me is you would actually enjoy being in some sort of group. So whether it's a psychic development Monday night, the local, you know, tarot crystal store, um, I think, you know, that would really help you out a lot. And so I would look That's locally true. there. And be, That's true. We don't have that you know, many. And I'm telling you what, the, you know, I don't know you. I'm just telling you what they're whispering in my ear. I think you would enjoy just the fellowship of that group. Um, being in a group, I mean, Tony and I have spoken before hundreds and hundreds of people, and that's, you know, nerve-wracking for anybody. I don't care who you are. So you just show up as somebody to be a lot more comfortable in a small, more intimate group um, and learning that way for now. Um, but, you know, again, I'll help you any way I can. I do have mastery for people that want to work on themselves and their loved ones and their pets. And that's one course. Everything is online. It's all at your own pace. It's very reasonable. It's a couple hundred bucks uh, for practitioner training. If you go on to do that, uh, it's like four hundred dollars. And so the point is, for six hundred bucks, just by just to give you an example of the time and the energy, it would cost you for basic theta healing. It's really an all-day Friday, Saturday, Sunday. It's about six hundred dollars, and then you go to advance maybe a month later, and that's another six hundred dollars. Uh, Cam Ewan, who I love, Ewan Method, he's offered his modules out right now. It's $2,750 all online. So, you know, we looked at our stuff for many, many years. I've uh, web people, I've got lawyers, I've got accountants and CPAs and my social media girl who I love. And Tiffany is the radio producer. And all these people really had input on this. And we said, hey, how can we make this simple and yet deep and yet reasonably priced. So that's what we did. So if you email me privately, it's info at jimmymachealing.com. I'll send you all the information for free. You can at least read over it. If you decide to do it, welcome aboard. Um, But I just see you as what they call a two-prong approach. You could be doing my stuff online, which is very direct and straightforward. It's about audios and you listen to and videos you watch. It's very simple, but it's deep. And then by the same token, you you kind of want to be two-stepping this and going to once a week to some sort of class locally. Does that make sense? Yeah. So recently I took an animal communicator class. Did I get anything out of that? Um, it it tests weak to me. I'm just, you know, I don't know the people or I can't rule on that. I have had, I do, I work on pets every day all over the world, but whatever reason that test kind of weak for you. And again, it may be the greatest course in the world, but it's didn't resonate with you, uh, and I'm just letting you know it's never out of judgment. I'm just telling you what comes through. Right. And okay. you know, if I can, if I can chime in really quickly, Kathy. Sure. Again, you, you, um, you, you really want these things, and you want overnight results, and you get frustrated when you don't th- see things very, very quickly. You want something yeah. that you can see working now. You, you are. It, it's like buying. It's kind of like buying a car for you. You walk in, you put your money down, you leave with the car. But in the spiritual realm, sometimes we have to take off layers of dust, is what I'm going to call it, old energy before these new awakenings come in or we wake up to what we came in with. Because we all came in with these gifts. Just some of us have, you know, shrouded them, so to say. You know, animal communication, you're, and you're, the other aspect of this is you're so afraid what people are going to say and think about what you do. You love all things spiritual. You love all things like uh, in this realm. But there's a part of you that is a little bit fearful that people are going to say, she's crazy. 
<laughs> so, and I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm I think that very, very strong for you. <laughs> like, yeah, you don't I'm wondering want... if it comes from a past life or something. Uh, pr- probably. I And from this life, I mean, just think about it. Everybody in this world, in the, not everybody, but we live in an environment that's so black and white and, you know, fear filled sometimes. So we, we, it takes a lot for us to step outside of that box. What I'm going to say is um, this is a, for you, it's an all or nothing game. You're all open or you're all closed and you're afraid to be all open. That goes with love too, sweet girl. So once you start opening up all these other things, your heart is just going to explode. And all of this does come from love. The amount of mm-hmm. love that you can give and receive is the amount of intuition or spirituality that is booming at your door, so to say. So why don't we have Jimmy do a quick healing on your spiritual path so you can be open to the right modality at the right time? And again, real quick. Yeah, and we'll just, what yeah that's an excellent get into, idea. Hmm? Yeah. And what you're going to get into, stick with it for at least six months. So if it's Jimmy's program, and I hope it is because you'll see instant results, and it will open up your intuition even more, um, stick with it for six solid months. Dedicate six months to it. Okay, Jimmy, I'm down. Yeah, (laughs) Uh, yeah, go ahead, Kathy. Stand up, and this is for everybody. So here we go. We'll just download it for everybody. If you want to stand up, face due north. Mm -hmm. All right. And I get that there's weakness in your spiritual path. That's going to pull you forward to yes. And we're going to do it for everybody who's listening now or in the future. You're going to feel a pull forward on Kathy. And it feels like it's drifting forward. Does that make sense? So we're going to release all this weakness in the spiritual path of you and everybody who's listening now and ever will listen into the future and release it, resolve it, delete and erase it into the void. It'll pull you back when it leaves. And it's going now. No, it's really going back. (laughs) Yeah, well, that's because we're doing Uh it for everybody, not just you, sweetie. So we're just dialing in. And then as soon as that, you'll feel it pull, pull, pull. It'll drop you off in neutrality once it's done. Feel that movement, and we're a live radio show, so that's the only reason I'm talking while it's happening. And then you'll feel a neutrality, it'll bring you back to that neutral place. And okay. we're just deleting out all those things, yeah. And I do feel like it's a lot of past life, too. Um, you know, listen, I, I love Rudy Hunter, he's out of New York, and right on live on his site, he's, his tab is called the Woo Woo Store. How bold is that, right? <laughs> so, hey, I'm gonna call it Woo Woo, I'm gonna call it the Woo Woo Store. So he's got stuff. Elma Meyer's got great stuff. Baby healing is fantastic. It's whatever you're drawn to. So right now I'm just going to say uh, we're going to believe, think, know, and feel, be ready, willing, and able to know when, we're how, and why. To have the ideal spiritual path show up for Kathy here and now, and everybody ever hears the sound of my voice today and in the future. Let's have the ideal modality, technique, and belief structure the ability to create profound changes mentally, physically, spiritually show up for everybody here and now. Pull her straight forward when you bring it in. And this is going to pull you straight forward. It's going to feel like somebody's filling you up. You'll yeah. feel that pull. And then it's going to bring you back to neutral once it's done. And we don't need to know every little silly nuance or every little thing. We just know that there's movement here. There is change. And that's change you can feel without question. Mm-hmm. Feel that? Uh, thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, and believe me, sweetie, I've done them all. I did uh, Reiki and reconnective healing and matrix energetics and UN method and theta healing and excess consciousness and Reiki and just everything <laughs> access. I did the monks. I did everything I could do. And if I could find something deeper, cheaper, faster than this, I'd be doing that. Okay. So you can, it's this change you can feel. It's undeniable. I've worked on engineer, doctor, lawyer, Indian chief. It's 
still going to drag them all around the room because at the end of the day, wink, wink, it's the Holy Spirit anyway. So you just can't deny it. It's physics meets the Holy Spirit. So even non-believers start getting a little amazed when I'm pulling them around the room if they're in Paris, France, or Alaska, or wherever they are. So it's mm-hmm. undeniable. So makes sense? Wow. So, yeah, thank all you. All right, so you're welcome, and thank thanks you, for Dr. calling in. And We'll help you any way we can, and I encourage you to reach out to Tony G., uh, .info, of course, if you want to go deeper. And a lot of the stuff we'll tell you might be superficial on the radio today. I know she's getting hit, and so am I, how much deeper we could go, but that's for another day and another session, okay? Okay. Thank you both. Thank you, Tony. Thank you. Thank Thanks you. For Thank you. Take care. All right. Hey, Carolyn, Excellent. 818 from California. How are you this morning or this afternoon? I should oh, say it's oh. morning in Cali, right? Yes, uh, I'm doing great. Uh, how are both of you? Oh, we're doing great, honey. It's fantastic. Mm-hmm. We've got some rain here, so we're happy about that. And I know Tony's staying busy, too, so it's all good. Did you have a question? Oh. Yes, I do. I wanted to know from Tony, do I have any messages from the uh, other side? Yeah, instantly. You know what, sweetie? Instantly. um now I'm seeing a couple people, but I'm just gonna choose one, but because they all bring the same message. Okay, they all for the first then and, and you know it's a, from the other side. The first message for me that I always give is we love you, we love you, and we're with you. We love you, and we're with you. Don't think of us as separated from you. You think that we have left you, but we are right there with you. Um, and wow. this person is a little bit older, and at first I thought it was a guy, but because the hair is like minimal hair, but it's a woman, and she's shorter and stockier, she's wearing a house dress. Um, she's calling it a house dress. It's like a cotton dress and um, and house slippers or house shoes. Wow. So you know who this is, right? You know who this is? Uh, it might be my maternal grandmother. Okay. What Unless she is, she's part of my she she was very stocky, short, and her hair was almost um, non-existent in the end. Okay, like she was almost bald, or there were, it was so short it didn't matter. Okay. Okay. So she just wants you to know, and she brings the message from all of them that they love you, and they want you to know to lift yourself up. Lift yourself up is the word I'm getting. Lift yourself up. And don't uh, be downtrodden and um, in that place of remorse so much, okay? Okay. All right. Does that yeah. make sense? Yeah. Does that make sense oh, yeah. to you, sweetie? Good, yes, good, 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 good. I'm so, grateful. Um, excellent. Now, on that note, it, it, sometimes it's hard to get out of that space of being downtrodden or you know, to lift ourselves up, sometimes there's a little something that needs to go, and maybe that's what Jimmy can do for you today is help to remove some of that stuff that's been kind of holding you in pause because that's what they're saying. You're stuck a little bit. Oh, okay. Jimmy? Yes, I, need to I, I, get, I get you're a little stuck and a little bored, actually. So stand up, yeah. Carolyn. You know what to do. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm up and I'm bored, yes. That's true. Yeah. So stand up, face due north, and just say, I feel stuck and bored. You'll feel the pull forward. I feel stuck and bored. Yes, it threw me forward. Release it, resolve it, delete and erase it, disentangle them all out now into the void. Pull her straight back when you're done. Thank you. I'm done. It threw me straight back. Straight back. I love it. Makes sense? Nice. Yeah, yeah. Yes, and it's nice. like. You feel, they're saying you feel really, uh, you're just busy being busy. Does that make sense? Yes, and I'm I'm trying to, I'm at a standstill trying to figure out what else I should do. I'm retired, and I did some healing work, mm-hmm. uh, hands-on healing. And uh, when I talk to people, I know that I'm channeling information to them. So I haven't sat down and did readings, but I, I can't. I really don't want to do that. And uh, I don't even want to do healing anymore. And I said, what's wrong with me? So I guess I'm bored. I just want to know if there's something else I could do. I, I know I could uh, volunteer in hospitals. I uh, know I should be writing a book, but I want to be in a good frame of mind before I yeah. start that. 
you know, I get that this is kind of summer blues, if that makes sense. You've got about about four weeks out, so they're saying about 30 days out. I feel like you're going to snap back into being more open to that. I'd be open to all those things, but it's up to you. You know, it's not for everybody. Uh, the first yeah. chapter of my practitioner handbook is all about uh, client unrealistic expectations, right? So, Tony, yeah. G can laugh when I say that because, you know, I've got people yeah. tell me, Jimmy, make me taller, make my nose shrink. It's like, what? You know, it's like, come on. Yeah. You know, at some point it just gets silly, right? So we want to bring it in in a practical way. And, you know, you got to realize that's what you're opening yourself up to. So I think you're kind of fearful of that, if you will. Uh, but at the end of the day, what I, what drives me is to be helpful and contributing to everybody and everything and realize, hey, if that's their issue with their puppy dog or kitty cat or their uncle is mean to them or whatever, that's their issue. So I'm going to just, you know, go like a madman to try and help them with whatever they perceive as their issue. So I feel like within the next 30 days, you're going to get your head around that and you might be a whole lot more open to that. I'd like to see you take some more, like, vitamin B in the morning, uh, kind of get yourself jumped up a little bit more. I, I think you, vitamin B. Okay. you're, like, taking naps with a nap coming on. So uh, it just feels yeah. kind of foggy right now. Does that and, make sense? You know, yes, it does. Yeah. Yeah. And can I just – can I add one more sure. quick thing here? That That's what kind of, like, what they're talking about with that downtrodden. And what they're saying is you're spending way too much time alone. You oh, need to get a sister, a friend, somebody you can have like little finger sandwich lunches with. You don't have to go any place and do it. You can do it at home. You just need to laugh. You need to joke with somebody. You just been spending a little bit too much time alone. If I were pulling cards and I don't know anything about cards, but they're showing me if I were pulling cards on you, the hermit card would come up. <laughs> so you idea. need to get your butt out. You need to you need to get on the phone with some of your girls or, or uh, somebody that you can laugh with, and you need to bring some light back in, okay? Okay. Okay, I'm going to work on all those things. Thank you. Both. You're welcome. Thank you for You're coming welcome. in, love. Appreciate you listening. Yeah. Oh, okay. Folks, great. A lot of folks on hold, uh, press one. If you want to get a message live or you need a healing, just press the one and that'll raise your hand. So we appreciate everybody listening as well. Seven, uh, also, I want to mention Tony G, tell them what your website is. We're like halfway, more than halfway through the show. So tell them about your website, maybe how to call you, get a hold of you. What's your email address, love? Absolutely. So my website is Tony, T O N I. G dot info and on my website it's it's uh i do it myself so it's <laughs> yeah excuse forgive any imperfections in my website but on the first page right now on my home page i'm running a special for a phone reading so if you go to my website and you want a phone reading you can click on that button um get that phone reading call me up we'll schedule your appointment um you can also see my past TV shows and watch my radio shows and uh, get information on some of the work that I do. You can see the way I work and what I do, kind of like you are here. If you choose to email me, please make it a short email. I am all about the talking, not about the reading. But I will read a short email. My email address is tg24721 at AOL.com. I'm the one holding AOL alive still. Yep, I am. Okay. <laughs> I love that. Well said, right? Hey, you, I'm you, really loyal. You, you in Wisconsin and one of my best, dearest, sweet, uh, angry Jewish man out of South Florida. I love him. David, I love you. He's been my friend 30 <laughs> years, and he's still got AOL. And I yes. send him stuff, and he goes, hold on, I'll turn it on. And I can hear in the background going, you got mail. And I go, oh, my God, I haven't heard that in 25 <laughs> yes. years, right? Yes, but I'm, so. I'm painfully loyal. Is thank that what you. we could say once I'm with something? I just stick with it. AOL, well, thank up. you, right, for being some yes. of the last people on earth with AOL. What a dream. No, that's great, yes. folks. And I'd highly recommend her for 
any reading you might want to go in deeper with today. And, and we're just so glad you joined us today. And we just mix it up and have fun if you can't tell that already, right? 770 is our next caller. Hi, that sounds like an Atlanta extension. What's your name? Where are you calling from? 770. I'm Sandy, and I'm calling from Atlanta. Hey, Sandy, how are you? You have a question for Tony G today? Um, I think uh, I'm kind of looking at the healing. Okay. What's going on, love? Well, uh, my leg is, is just driving me crazy, and uh, I think it's partly calcium, and, you know, not enough calcium and things like that. But well, it's I guess just, that you're not, it's, not, it's not calcium, it's magnesium for you. So that's one thing that would really help you out with muscle. Most people are, when I ask spirit, is it bone cartilage, muscle, um, you know, tendon or ligament, it's generally it's tendon weakness, and you have tendon weakness too. What do the MDs say? Have you been to a chiropractor? What's everybody telling you? Um. Uh, they really didn't tell me much, and uh, I did. Uh, I was low on vitamin D, okay. and so yeah, that's true. so that you know kind of makes it hard to absorb things. Right. And uh, but I don't think that she said I was low in magnesium. Yeah, I'm telling you, you are though. And when I say magnesium, oh. I mean you need to be taking Epsom salts, baths, things like that. People are the lavender or non-lavender. You're non-lavender. You go to any Walmart, go to any any uh, of the little stores, you know, Walgreens, CVS, whatever. Get, get yourself some magnesium. I would put a cup and, uh, and mix it into a shallow bath. That's going to help you out a lot, and you end up absorbing more that way. It relaxes your muscles. That would go a long way to help you. You want to stand up and feel the energy? Okay. Yeah, and vitamin D test strong for you that you need it, magnesium. There's also a liquid form you could get that would be more effective and even faster, they're saying. So, uh, magnesium or what? Uh, yeah, I'm saying magnesium and vitamin D. You test deficient in those things as well, so you need both. Okay. But I'm telling you right now that, you know, when I ask bone, muscle, ligament, tendon, joint, you have joint pain. That's really what you got going on. So if you can stand up right now, it's Sandy, right, and face due north. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And you just feel the weakness in that leg. This is I'm putting the weakness of the leg above your head. It's going to pull you backwards. You're going to feel like a drift backwards. We're going to release that weakness, disentangle it, uncollapse it, take it all out now. Pull her straight forward when you bring in only positive strength. Thank you. And you're going to feel what feels like kind of a wave of pushing you around a little bit. And it's taking out all that weakness. It'll pull back, 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 and then it's going to drop you forward to positive strength. Feeling that? What? Are you feeling that? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, let us know because it's a radio show live, babe. <laughs> <laughs> and I also, uh, they're talking about impactful exercise immediately. There are never words I would use. That's how Tony G and I would know it was spirit. Impactful exercise is even a part of my vocabulary. So the point is, you need to do things that are going to be more strengthening, and that's why you kind of have a sloppy tendon issue going on. You also have inflammation. I'm just taking it out as we talk about it right now really quick, and you really need to do more impact types of things. It can be lightweight training with, uh, you know, the Nautilus elliptical equipment. Even if you did one little plate, tiny plate, you need some more movement, and that will strengthen the muscles around this particular tendon and joint, you got some joint inflammation too. Does that make sense? And, um, Go ahead, jump in, love. Uh, I, and if you don't mind, would you mind if I gave you some information that I'm getting? Okay. Um, the the main message that I'm getting for you, and they, they say this with love, is that um, you tend to hold very tightly to the past, things that have happened, 
And um, I, I'm hearing the statement, like, somebody done somebody wrong song, which, again, I, that, that is definitely spirit coming through because I am not, that is not my vocabulary. Um, but they're saying if you can find a way to help you start letting go of things, all this um, tightness and stuff that you've been holding on to is now starting to present in the body. And if you can let go of some of these things, however is best for you to let go of them, you're going to find your body is much more free-flowing and you're going to feel um, healthier and stronger in a very short period of time. And, you know, we've all been, we've all been hurt. We've all been through things. We've all hurt people. Um, and it's sometimes it's difficult because we use that hurt as a protective device. Like if, if I hold on to this, it won't happen again sort of thing going on or uh, whatever our justification is. And sometimes we don't even realize we're holding on to things. But if you can find a way to start letting go of some of the stuff from the past, I feel like you're going to have a, a healthier physical being too. Okay. Jimmy? Awesome. Yeah, and I would I would encourage you too. You don't have to do Nautilus weight training, any of that, but you need to be doing something. I tell everybody Tai Chi, Qigong, um, yoga, you know, Zumba class. My latest thing I've discovered is water class. They call it aqua class here. We all go to LA Fitness. It's a dream. I go like six days a week and you know, I really, really enjoy it. They use the little light weights in there, and you're dancing and moving. You don't even realize an hour's up. It flies by. But if you can do things like that, you're going to feel a million percent better. Because if we lay around, we just end up getting more laying around. Does that help? Right. Okay, yeah. Awesome. Yeah, and if you reach out to me, it's info at jimmymachealing.com. I'll gladly send you, um, you know, I don't sell product, but I'll certainly – give you what spirits are recommending as far as you taking different products and how much a day, that sort of thing. I just give all that out for free. So you could write me anytime, info at jimmymachealing.com and just mention Sandy from Atlanta and about the joint issues and I'll send you some information, some things you might want to look into, read about and take. Okay, love? Okay, thank you. Awesome. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thanks for calling in. 434 is our next caller. Hi, what's your name? Where are you calling from? Oh, hi, Jenny. It's Leanne in Virginia. I'm just intrigued by your caller. How are you? And just Thank you. I'm glad you called uh, anybody in. that communicates in that other uh, realm, I have a, I'm curious about any messages from people or pets. Because sometimes okay. I love animals more than people. <laughs> Leanne, instantly I see a little dog. It was white with brown. I feel like it was a short-haired dog. Now, sometimes oh dogs, um, it, it, do, do you know which dog this is? Because this is the dog that... Oh, you're making me cry. That's my dog that just died. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry, love. Oh, don't make me cry. Oh, I'm wow. so sorry, love. And you just oh, described well, her. Oh, well, I'm so happy. She is like got the biggest smile on her face. Her oh. tail is just a wagon and she is just like, she's in the field. She's in the field. There are a bunch of other dogs behind her and she's <laughs> wanting to convey the pain is gone. The pain is gone. The pain is gone. The pain is gone. And she's, um, oh, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna hold it together for this. <laughs> she is <laughs> very happy and She's thankful you gave her such a good life. She says, thank you, thank you, Mommy, thank you. <laughs> All that so, sweet. Yeah, so <laughs> she wants you to know um, she still is, um, she's sharing me, she slept, she's, I don't know if she slept on the bed when she was with you, but she's showing me she's sleeping in the middle of the bed now. Uh so if you're on the, like, she sleeps right in the middle now of the bed. So yeah, she, she's going she, there. Yeah, I kind of spoiled my animals I, uh, yeah. badly. <laughs> so, yes, yeah, she slept in the bed. Yeah, <laughs> she's showing me she's still there. She, she, she climbs in, and she's still there with you. And, not, and she will do that for um, 
for a little bit still. She's going to be there for a little bit still, uh, hanging out and helping you, uh, re- you know, I don't want to say recover because I don't think we ever do, but but um, until you're in like a higher vibrational place with this. Okay? Okay. Oh, so, so it, yeah. How does that help, love? Sounds good, right? That, that was really sweet. That is sweet. Oh, and one, is one in a million for somebody that, that she doesn't know that, that that little sneak slept in the bed with you. That's quite funny, really. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. That's great confirmation. She described her perfectly. Perfectly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Thank That's you. What she Thank like. you for that confirmation. Yeah. Well, oh, thank you. She That's a neat stuff. message. Jimmy, are my parasites cleaning out? I, I'm I'm working on that cleanse. D- d- is it getting a little it's, better? It's, it's a huge yes. It feels like it a yes. Yeah. How do you feel? You've got um, to feel, be feeling better yeah, slowly but surely. It feels like it's slow. Everything seems to work a little slow, slow with me. Yep. So I, I, yeah. I don't know if I'm going to have to do this longer or repeat it. But yes, I, I you're going to have to repeat it over time, sweetie. Nine out of ten people walking around got parasites. You could eat a apple from the farmer's market. We have salads and get them through scallions. Uh, my dear attorney friend always eats sushi. I just cringe, you know, you can imagine, right? You're just begging to dump parasites into your system. So uh, a lot of times people are walking around dazed and confused. They sleep half the day away or they're depressed, and nine t- out of ten times it's parasites. So, yeah, they're talking about they're going to have to do it more more than once, obviously, and just keep going. Okay. But I feel like the longer you do it, the better you're going to get. How I've got two more weeks of it, and how long should I take a break before I start it again? Oh, I wouldn't even take a break. I'd just keep going. You know, if yes. you're sick of it and you're just sick of dealing with it, you could take a couple weeks off. That's fine. Okay. Well, it, it, it's okay. That I, I was just curious. I wondered. I would keep going. I would just do a little bit every night until the end of time, probably. To keep doing yeah. it. Just keep I would keep doing it. It doesn't hurt. No, the only thing that what you're taking, and, and I did find a special formula for those that are ate up by parasites, just email me, info at jimmymachealing.com. And I don't sell product, but I'll certainly recommend some stuff. And that, that's the best stuff I've ever seen as far as parasites go. And my dear friend who's a physician, board certified, we both took Flagyl, a prescription, and that didn't kill off what we had going on. And I had everybody take this stuff, including him, and he felt immensely mentally sharper in the next couple, three weeks. So we knew this was really a special formula. So keep us posted, okay? Yeah, thanks for calling in, love. I'll help you any way I can. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye. 650, we got one more caller here for time at least. Hi, what's your name? Where are you calling from? Hi, my name is Miranda. I'm calling from California. What did you say it was, honey? Miranda? Yes, yeah. Okay, you have a question for Tony G. Um, yeah, I'm holding space for healing uh, the scalp, reju- rejuvenating my hair follicles, and just wondering what she picks up, what either of you pick up. Okay, um, I'm I'm really sorry. I'm I'm not sure I understood what you said. Oh, it's okay. I can repeat it. I'm holding space uh, to rejuvenate my hair follicles. There's been hair thinning over the years, and um, just want um, you know want to regenerate to get a nice thicker, fuller head of hair. Okay, so instantly. Okay, thank you for repeating that. I'm really sorry. Um, the first thing I'm getting is that there's um I'm getting the that there's a supplement that's that you need to add into this. One really good supplement is biotin, but another one that I'm getting that would be really good for you. I don't know the full on word of it. It's a very long word, but the abbreviation is BAPA, B A P A or B A B A, and that would be really 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 essential for you also. If you're not already taking either of those, you might want to look at um, investing in both of them. Um, it's, it's something, it's a nutrient that's missing from the inside, not something that's happening on the outside is the biggest message 
that I'm getting. So would you agree with that, Jimmy? Yeah, absolutely. It's all internal. It tests as minerals. Mm -hmm. uh, people can take our little uh, Flintstone vitamins, and you can flush them right down the toilet. We're all deficient in minerals. That's one man's opinion. It's just what I've seen over time. You definitely want to take multi-minerals. If you send me an email, info at jimmymachealing.com, I'll certainly send you several options. Again, I don't sell product, but I'll test what works best for you. But you definitely need multi-minerals. You don't test weak in calcium. You do test deficient in magnesium. And that's more about relaxing and muscle relaxing and that sort of thing. Uh, you know, it's something you're concentrating on, you're uptight about. I just see you almost running to the mirror every hour going, you know, it's kind of like the, the meme joke is the girl's crying on the bed and she goes, I don't understand this, why I'm not skinny yet. I've been, I haven't eaten all morning. So, you know, that's the joke. And, and it's, I almost see this, you know, and this, part of this is pulling my hair out over emotional things too. Um, it's generally, it's not from your mother's side. They're saying it's from your father's side, the thinning hair over time. Uh, but I feel like, you know, with doing some of these supplements, things Tony's recommended, also the multi-minerals, that would go a long way of, uh, of helping you. You want to stand up and feel the energy real quick? Sure. Awesome. So just face due north. I'm not sure where north would be. <laughs> well, I'm going to put it right in front of you wherever you're standing up. How about that? That sounds good. Sun comes up in the east and turn to the left, but here we go. So just think of your hair right now thinning. That's going to be a weakness. It's going to feel like somebody's dropping you backwards. You'll feel the push back or the drop back. Okay. And that's the weakness in your hair and hair follicles, and we're going to release it, resolve it, delete and erase it now, disentangle it into the void, drop in only positive strength into her hair, her hair follicles, and her mineral absorption now, and now it's going to pull you forward to yes. Yep. There you go. Feels like a little wave. Makes sense? It does. Yep. Awesome, and, love. You know, yeah. real quick, I know we're we're coming toward the end of the hour here, but real quick, whatever is affecting, whatever mineral and vitamins you're lacking that is affecting your hair, it is also affecting your... I'm going to say, I don't want to say brain function because that sounds too big, but your thought processes, the way you're processing thoughts and the way that you are thinking or not thinking throughout the day, once you, you know, definitely do reach out to Jimmy and have him test you for uh, what you need because once you get on them, within three days, you are going to be writing him an email telling him what a profound difference these this has made it's whatever this is my bottom line is whatever this is it's not only affecting your hair that's an end result to what it has already done the lack of this has already done to um the inside of you now it's starting to show up on the outside of you does that make sense to you love yes it does mm -hmm. good okay thank you thanks okay. for calling in we appreciate it honey Reach out any time. We'll help you any way we can, okay? Thank you. Thanks Thank for calling. You, Thank you. Sure. Yeah. Hey, Tony G., thanks for being on the show today, love. We had fun. I appreciate it. Hey, Jimmy, it was it was such an honor. Thank you for inviting me, and I'm so grateful that I could uh, be here with you. Thank you so much. Yeah. Tell folks how to get a hold of you, honey. Tell them about the website and a phone number or email. Okay, so my website is Tony, T-O-N-I-G dot info, and my phone number is 414-897-2869. Awesome. And Thanks that's, so much. Yeah, that's me. Show. Thanks. Yeah, I love it. And AOL, she's one of the surviving <laughs> yes. founders of AOL. I love it. I, I love am. it. They got Somebody has to keep them alive. It will be yeah, don't cry. Don't cry too hard for them. They got a lot of money, babe, and they have Yahoo now, too, so it's all good. Hey, folks, thanks yeah. for listening today. We're thrilled that you were here. Also, just know anybody that listens to the replay. And by the way, we're now on iHeartRadio, so we're excited about that. Reverend mm -hmm. Tiffany knows we're really uh, pumped up about that. So we're on Spreaker. We're on iHeart. If you want to hear any of the archive shows, you just go to jimmymachealing.com forward slash interviews. There's like a cabillion of them there. We're all over YouTube, a bunch of different places, of course. You can always catch up. And just know that if somebody has the same hair issue or thinning, 
that if you just concentrate for a minute, we can ask that spirit will also change that for you and your life. So anything that you find that's a challenge, you might resonate with the caller. Uh, just know that it can change for you, even if you're just listening to a replay of the show. That's how pervasive, that's how strong, that's how awesome and just wild spirit can be. And it just it forever amazes me, and that's what's exciting to me. So reach out anytime, folks, so we can help you. It's jimmymachealing.com. And I want to wish everybody that the rest of your life will be the best of your life. And remember to make progress every day. Thanks, everybody. Bye-bye. Okay. Thanks. Bye-bye. Hi, this is Maury Moreland Morrison, here to tell you GEICO has more than just great savings. Much more. Yes, while GEICO could help you rack up more moolah faster than you can say metamorphosis, they've also been the fastest growing auto insurer for more than 10 years. That's more like it. Furthermore, GEICO has fast and friendly claim service. That might seem like an oxymoron, but it's not. All the more reason to say no other auto insurer has more more than GEICO. GEICO. Expect great savings and a whole lot more. When I grow up, I want to make a pizza with the most cheese and the most pepperoni at the nation's best price. Six dollars. It's going to be the best pizza ever. Sorry, kid. It's been done. Introducing the new Little Caesars Extra Most Bestest Pizza, a large pizza with the most cheese and the most pepperoni at the nation's best price. But my mom said... Shh. This much cheese and pepperoni is what dreams are made of. Come get a large, hot and ready, extra most bestest pizza for just six bucks, only at Little Caesars. Pizza, pizza. At participating locations plus tax.